no mistake about it. Uh, we will find you, we will arrest you, and we will prosecute you to the fullest extent of the law. Governor Larry Hogan says successful results from the Joint Law Enforcement Violent Crime Initiative are just the beginning. The Seven Centuries operation targeting the most violent criminals in Baltimore City included nearly 500 federal, state, and local law enforcement officers and focused on reducing crime by getting criminals with open warrants off of Baltimore City streets. And this is the template by which all other uh, fugitive initiatives and roundups should be measured. The operation was conducted from January 16th to February 15th and zeroed in on wanted individuals who are known gang members, sex offenders who failed to register, felons with violent criminal records, and those who have warrants related to the sale or possession of drugs. According to investigators, the 300 open warrants narrowed down from 7,200 led to the arrest of 259 people for murder murder, attempted murder, guns, drugs, and aggravated assault charges. It was very effective. Commissioner-designate Daryl D'Souza says the aggressive initiative put violent criminals on notice moving forward. We are coming to look for you um, regardless of the type of warrant, um, regardless of where you go in the city or the state. Uh, we're coming to get you. Mayor Catherine Pugh stressed that the collaborative assistance is part of what she requested when she first came into office, and the initiative will continue throughout the year. We can make Baltimore one of the safest cities in America. It is how we collaborate. It's how we work together. It's how we recognize when we have a problem that we need assistance and we reach out. And so investigators say that officers checked more than 44,000 locations during the operation and 21 gang members were arrested, most from the Black Gorilla family. Reporting live at Baltimore City Police Headquarters tonight, Kyrie, WBAL, TV 11 News.